Not life, but a good life, is to be chiefly valued. Be present. Many of us go through the day on autopilot. How often does someone say something to you and you haven't listened to a single word that they said? Or driving 80 miles per hour and everything around you is a total blur? Or the last time you actually tasted your food before swallowing? Sometimes we don't value the time we spend doing the little things. For example, like taking a long walk in the park and actually looking at the surroundings, not answering our phones every five minutes to see if we got an Instagram post, and learning to love and embrace the bodies we were blessed with instead of obsessing over supermodels we see on TV. Being more present day to day can make life less stressful and more satisfying. Practicing gratefulness. Being thankful shouldn't happen only on Thanksgiving, but every day of your life. Pretend to be grateful even if you don't feel like you are. Things happen day to day that we're not always prepared for. Never take anything for granted because nothing's prompt. Being grateful helps you see the good in your life and the things that come out of it. I know one thing I'm grateful for, and that's God and my family. There wouldn't be a future without them. I cherish my family because at any time they can be taken from me. And without God, well, there wouldn't be any type of future for me because he's given me so many blessings. Learn how to balance your life. Don't focus so much on one aspect of your life. I mean, is your life really all about working? Learning how to balance your life allows you to achieve your goals, enhance your emotional and physical well-being. Work-life balance struggle can diminish your happiness and make it hard for you to spend time with family and friends. If you work so much that you barely have time to spend with your family at the dinner table, well, then it's time to prioritize your life a little bit differently. There's nothing wrong with having a little me time. Nurture friendships. When genuine people come knocking on your door, be sure to welcome them in with open arms. Good long-lasting friendships make life less stressful. Don't make a person your best friend that you barely know. Befriend a person that's loyal, always going to be there right by your side, and caring. It's not always good to have a lot of friends, especially if you know that they'll turn on you at any given moment. A great friend may be hard to find, but it sure is worth it. Lastly, keep it simple. You don't need to have designer jeans and $200 shoes to make you love your life. You don't need relationships that are so involved in drama that you often dislike being around people. Enjoy things that are useful, not just because they're expensive. When you learn to love the basics, you'll find so much appreciation for the nicer things in life. And that's the good life.